From Washington, D.C., this is the TVNews.TV for Tuesday, October 11th, 2011. Brought to you by Original Productions, the powerhouse in reality television. Original Productions, a Fremantle Media Company. Visit them at OridgeProd.com. Hello, I'm Jeff Grimshaw, and we begin with our exclusive New Media, New Marketing Report. Here now from San Francisco is Combridge's John Leland. Thanks, Jeff. Yeah, you know, the, the world of the multi-screen TV delivery environment could not be changing more rapidly. And it really, in the last week, we've had three major new movements, the most recent being Netflix backing down on dividing itself into two companies um, and going with the unified umbrella that most customers seem to want. My quick comment there is that uh, we are in a transition. They were making a statement about streaming being their future, and I still believe it is. But we have consumers who are still watching DVDs, and you really have to serve customers where they are today. The second big announcement was the iPhone 4S. Um, you know, now doing HD video, uh, moving that platform to another level, um, you know, going to continue to go forward. And, you know, my heart really goes out to everybody around the loss of Steve Jobs. That was a major event, um, you know, of a multi decade uh, level. And the biggest uh, innovation, I think, of the last week has to go to Amazon's Kindle Fire. Really an interesting media consumption alternative at only $200 um, with a new rebuilt browser um, extending the amazing Amazon uh, customer experience into really what looks like a breakthrough device. I actually want to get my hands on one and compare the experience with the iPad. But the mobile delivery platform is enhanced by the entry of the Kindle Fire, and we are just seeing things continue to accelerate. They're going to continue to accelerate, but these new kinds of watching environments are going to continue to make video and video delivery more and more viable in the mobile environment. So stay tuned. These really are exciting times. Well, we thank you, John. We look forward to your next new media, new marketing report available next Tuesday here at the TVNews.TV. The new media, new marketing report is brought to you by ComBridges. Website design, internet marketing, and social media strategies. Visit them at ComBridges.com. Saturday, November 12th, the Turner Alumni Group Celebration happens at the Hilton Atlanta. All Turner employees, past and present, are invited to join special honored guest Ted Turner, host Bill Tush, plus all of your Turner colleagues and pals for a mega event that's been three and a half decades in the making. For information and registration, head on over to the Turner Alumni Group Celebration page on Facebook. Okay, we now deliver a very warm greeting from your friends at Fox News Channel. Happy anniversary to us. Now pay the hell up. Fox News is utilizing its anniversary to jack up its carriage rates to ESPN levels. That's up to four clams per sub. Unfair? Well, who can say? After all, Fox News consistently delivers an audience that is in the top five of cable TV. So regarding Fox News cable rate increases, we report, you decide. Greetings, ladies and gentlemen, from the broadcast TV ratings flight deck. This is your captain, and I've turned on the fasten your seatbelt sign as Pan Am has hit some severe turbulence with a sudden drop in audience altitude by 27% in its last airing. Prepare for more rough air if Ratings for ABC's Pan Am don't climb soon. Oh, and by the way, your seat may be used as a flotation device. So sit back and enjoy your flight. And now this. Events and Opportunities, brought to you by Crawford Media Services. Create, post, archive, and manage your media with Crawford Media Services. Visit them at crawford.com. Anyone and everyone who has ever touched the Turner Empire past and present. Time is running short to register for the Turner Alumni Celebration. It happens November 12th at Hilton Atlanta. Yes, I will most definitely be there. Yes, I'm expecting to see you there as well. To register sooner rather than later, head on over to this link. If you want to talk to the real decision makers in the TV industry, sign on as a sponsor for the TV news. 
Now to get started, just email us at advertise at the tvnews.tv. And that about does it for this edition of the TV News. We invite you to stay close to us on Facebook, on the Twitter, and on LinkedIn. And here are all of the coordinates. I'm Jeff Grimshaw. We thank you for watching, and as always, go out and make it a good day.